All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Chupacabra Tutorials channel. I'm your host, Larry, and today we're going to answer the question, Larry, how do I better utilize the Discord search feature so I can actually find some information that I'm looking for? So the simple answer is, if you click on the search bar, the built-in Discord search will actually tell you all the different stuff that you need to know in order to search for whatever you're looking for. So you can add all of these different modifiers from user, mentions the user, contains a link or an embedded file or something, or occurs at a specific date in order to find the information that you're looking for. And you can combine multiple ones of these different qualifiers to your search in order to find specific things. So as an example, my buddy Lou, likes to host a movie night on his server fairly regularly where he watches with his audience that watches him stream on Twitch various different movies. And let's say that I was trying to remember the name of a movie so I could recommend it to a friend of mine, but I don't remember, but I do know that my buddy was playing it in one of his movie nights. So the first thing I would do is say, well, it's from user. And then we're going to go... Uh, Lupus Etor, and then I will say, uh, well, what date was this in? Um, it was probably in this channel, so I can say in this channel, and we'll say the um, now playing channel, and then I want this to also be in a specific date, so we're gonna go, uh, before and let's say it was sometime before March 3rd and this will allow me to go through all the posts he's made in that specific channel and I can look for it and say oh it was the Tiger's Apprentice that's the movie I was trying to think of or maybe it was the arcade movie whatever let's say that that's what I was looking for and then bing bang boom I'm done but you have a lot of options inside of here, and you can see your history of past searches down here at the bottom where you can clear those. And it gives you a lot of utility to say, like, I want to look for this information in this channel at this time. It might contain a link, uh, or it maybe it's a just a message that they've pinned. So I could say from my buddy again. And then we could go. Um, pinned and we'll say true and this will show all of the different stuff that he has pinned for different reasons so i guess he had a clip that he posted and pinned and then he also had an application to become one of his moderators so that's just a brief look at all of the different power that you have when using discord search in order to find specific information that you're looking for. It's really straightforward. Their categories are it's from a user or it mentions a user, or you could do both. You can have it uh, reference a link or an embedded image or file, and you can look on around specific dates and then whether or not it's a pinned message. It really covers just about everything. And this also includes the ability to search for information inside of group chats that you might be in for direct messages if you're not in a server with someone but you're in a group chat with them instead um, and while we're at the end here um, if you're interested in supporting the channel and you've been kind of interested in maybe getting and using an inexpensive vpn i do have an affiliate code down below for nordvpn nordvpn is a great vpn that allows you to log in from servers all across the globe you can literally just go through and pick the server that you want to by country. It's on a giant map. They also have built-in security to help keep you protected. They've got a built-in ad blocker so you don't get pestered by ads. It works on both desktop and on mobile. They've got an app for both iOS and on Android. And it's a fairly nice service. I've been using it off and on before becoming an affiliate for a couple of years. So if you ever find yourself in need of browsing privately using a VPN, which allows you to log into a server somewhere else, I definitely recommend NordVPN. And if you sign up with my discount code, 
which does give you a discount on the actual service, I get a kickback as well. So check it out if you're interested. Otherwise, have a good one, everybody, and I will catch you next time.